Hello, hello everyone. Hello guys. How are you guys today? I missed you guys. Guess what time it is? It is story time with Miss Doris. And we have our guest today, Pudgy the Puppet. Hello guys. Say hi to our friend, our guest friend today. I have an awesome book to read to you guys on today. Today's book we're going to be reading is Lucky Needs Help. Lucky Needs Help. It's our story, what we are going to be reading today. Lucky Needs Help. I'm so excited to be reading you guys a story on today. Hello and welcome to Storytime with Miss Doris. I'm going to go ahead on and get started. I would like to greet everyone all over the world. I would like to say hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and to some good night. Someone is going to bed somewhere in the world, but guess what? You are just in time for story time with Ms. Doris. I'm so excited to be reading you a book on today. Before we do that story time song, I'd like to give some shout outs. Shout outs to a few people. I'd like to give a shout out to you out there in story time land. Hello and welcome to story time with Miss Doris. I'd like to give a shout out to Joanne Williams out in Texas. Hello cousin, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday Glenda. How are you Miss Glenda on today? Happy birthday to you. I hope you are enjoying your special day. I'd like to say hello to Shalanda. Shalanda D. Hello, Miss Shalanda. Hilda Gig. Hilda Diggs. Hello and welcome to Story Time. Belil Shabazz, Mark B, Linda F, Marillo M, Vivian C, Kish L. Hello, guys. Fran Hernandez. Hello, Alexis J. Um, Rodney. Hello, cousin Rodney, Louisiana. Thanks for following Story Time. I appreciate you, Italia. Hello, Italia. Mary Coleman. Hello, guys. I appreciate all of you guys for watching and sharing story time with Miss Doris. You guys are awesome and phenomenal. I love all of you. I also like to give a shout out to my PLCC family. Hello, guys. Hello, Elect Lady Pastor Washington, BJ. Um, Mr. Ruben, hello guys, how are you guys on today? Hello brother artist, how are you on today artist? I hope you're having an awesome, awesome day. Hello Elder Rainey and Elect Lady Rainey, hello guys, I missed you guys. I know you're going to be tuning in. Hello and welcome to Storytime with Miss Stories. Today's book we're going to be reading is Lucky Finds, Lucky Needs help lucky needs help thanks so much for tuning in we're gonna go ahead on and get ready for that story time song i love that song when you guys are listening to that song there it goes make sure you are practicing safety first at all times story time hello and welcome story time it's story time Story time with Miss Shuri to you, sing to you, tell you all just what to do. Shuri to you, sing to you, tell you all just what to do. It's story time. Yes, I'm so excited to be reading to you on today. It's story time. Story time with Miss. It's story time. Story time with Miss Shuri to you. Sing to you. Tell you all just what to do. You guys were awesome. Yes, I'm ready to read you a story. Well, moms and dads and nanas and papas, go ahead on and have a seat. Enjoy your lunch while Miss Doris read you a story on today. Today's story we're going to be reading is Lucky Needs Help. Lucky Needs Help. 
I'm going to go ahead on and get started with our story. Sammy the puppet has been adopted and now lives in a new home. It's a big house where he can run and play with his favorite ball. Lucky also lives in the same house. Lucky is a cat. She doesn't want to play with Sammy. She finds him too noisy and too busy. She likes it when it's really, really quiet in the house. Lucky is lying on the couch in the living room, room napping. Sammy bursts out loudly from the kitchen, running after his ball. There he goes, disturbing the cat. She's getting really, really upset. Lucky looks up angry and leaves the living room. She goes into the kitchen. Uh-oh, Lucky isn't too happy with Sammy the puppy. Lucky jumps inside the closet to lie down. But the moment she lands on the towels, the door closes behind her. Sing to you, tell you all just what to do. What is she doing? What is she going to do? The towels are soft like Lucky expected, but it's too dark in the closet. Uh-oh, look where she got into. She ran into the wrong, wrong space. It's story time. Lucky starts to meow, meow. Maybe Sammy will hear her and help her. But Sammy is too busy playing in the living room. He's running after the ball and doesn't hear Lucky. Uh-oh, Lucky. Hopefully Sammy will hear you soon. Sammy is having too much fun playing with his ball. Lucky starts to meow harder. At that moment, Sammy's ball rolls towards the kitchen. Uh-oh, I think he hears something. Sammy lifts his head as he hears Lucky. He looks for her, but he doesn't see her. Where is she? <clears throat> story time with me, story. It's story time. Lucky meows one more time. Sammy approaches the closet where the string is hanging. He grabs the string with his teeth and pulls. The closet's door starts to move. He pulls harder and the door finally opens. Hello, Shikana. Hello, Shaquavia. How are you on today? Our story we're reading today is Lucky Needs Help. Lucky was very, very excited when the door opened. She started to climb down the cupboard while Sammy eagerly waited for her. There is Sammy the puppy. And we have our Muppet friend as well on today. Lucky jumps out. Thank you, thank you. You are welcome, says Sammy. How did you get in the closet? Lucky starts explaining the story to Sammy. Be careful next time, Lucky. Tell you all just what to do. Oh, I'm so cute. Lucky looks at the ball and acts shyly. 
Can I play with you? Of course, answered Sammy excitedly. Sammy and Lucky played the rest of the afternoon together with the ball. Just, just what to do. I'm glad Sammy found you, Lucky. From then onwards, Sammy and Lucky played together every, every day, except when Lucky wants to take a nap. Playing with a friend is always more fun than playing alone, but you also have to respect when someone wants to rest. The end. Oh, wow. That was an awesome, awesome story. I'm so glad Lucky and Sammy became friends, but Lucky wasn't too nice at first because she always wanted to take a nap and she didn't want to hear any, any noise from Sammy. Hello, Miss Veronica. How are you on today? Hello, my little handsomes. How are you? Well, guys, guess what? When you're playing with your family and friends, it's nothing wrong with sharing. Make sure you're sharing. We don't want to be selfish because Miss Doris says we can share our toys because someone may be less fortunate than you are. So make sure you are sharing and showing love and kindness. Thank you so much for the compliments. And remember, if you're not feeling well, always, always let someone know you're not feeling well. And mom and dads or nanas and papas or titis and uncles or cousins, they will take really, really, really good care of you because we don't want you guys getting sick at all. We don't want you getting sick. And remember, when you're outside playing with your family and friends, make sure when you come inside that you are washing and sanitizing your hands at all times because we don't want you guys getting sick at all. We want you well at all times. And don't forget, most, most importantly, when you're out in public with mom or dad or whomever you're out in public with and they give you your mask to put on, hello, Royce, hello, Miss Nisha, make sure you are wearing your mask. Yes, purple. What color is Miss Doris wearing on today? I bet you guys guessed it right. You are right, Shakana and Royce. Miss Doris is wearing the color purple. Purple stands for royalty. I love purple. I love you guys too. Don't forget, today's book we read was Lucky Needs Help. And when you're ever in need of help, always, always make a loud noise like Sammy, like Lucky did. She meowed, meow, meow. And Sammy the puppy found her. So if you guys ever need help, Make sure you make a loud noise so someone can follow the sound to get to you. You guys are awesome on today. I love you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to Storytime with Miss Doris. And if you're not smiling on today, guess what? Miss Doris has a smile just for you on today. Have an awesome day. Thanks, guys, for tuning in to Storytime with Miss Doris. Have an awesome day. A smile just for you. Sing to you, tell you all just what to do.